So, you may know that lighter colors keep you cooler during the summer, but do you know why? Whenever white light hits an object, the color that we see is the color that is not absorbed that is reflected back. So, in this case, the white light hits it and I'm able to see red because that's the color it's reflecting. Now, light is energy and the more energy something absorbs, the hotter it's going to be. A black shirt, it absorbs all light. Therefore, it's the hottest item literally that you can wear. A white shirt, even with a small pattern like this, is going to reflect most light and therefore be the coolest item you can wear. In today's video, I'm talking about hot weather hacks so you can look great and stay cool. The next hack, look for a soap bar that contains a cooling agent. You want to look for ingredients like menthol, peppermint oil, spearmint, basil, frescolate. By the way, frescolate is a menthol lactate. It's a natural alternative to menthol. Now, if you've got sensitive skin, you want to be really careful, maybe just try on a portion of your body. But for most of us, you're going to feel so much cooler and you may want to pack one of these for the gym to use later on. But guys, using a cooling soap is one of the best hacks, in my opinion, that most guys have never even tried. The next hack to deal with the heat, Avoid hot spots by going with looser clothing. I know a lot of you guys like your really close fitted shirts, your trousers, your skinny jeans. Here's the issue with this. When you start to sweat, all of a sudden it starts to rub you raw in those areas and guys, this can get painful. It can lead to irritation. It can lead to a rash. During the summer, don't be afraid to loosen up. Make sure that you've got shirts. Make sure that you've got trousers. Everything you're wearing is a bit looser. You should have no hot spots. The next hack to look great in the heat, leverage the power of performance fabrics. Now, if you go back and read some of these older men's style books, they're going to say, stay away from synthetics, only go with natural materials. The problem here is they're a bit dated because synthetic materials, specifically in the performance side, they have come leaps and bounds just in the last decade. A company right now that's killing it with performance fabrics in their dress shirts, Mizzen in Maine. The sponsor of today's video, guys, I'm wearing their shirt right now and I can tell you these dress shirts are comfortable as f now, gents, if you haven't been over to Mizzen and Maine's website, you want to go check them out. Look at all the different options they've got for you. And the thing I love about all of these shirts, we're talking moisture wicking. They're all machine washable. They're going to be wrinkle resistant. You no know dry cleaning needed at all. And that four way stretch. So if you're going to be traveling, if you're going to be out sweating in the heat, if you just simply want something to wear in the office that's incredibly comfortable, guys, go check out Mizzen and Maine. And besides a wide range of dress shirts, guys, they've got casual shirts like short sleeve and long sleeve Henleys. They've got t-shirts, they've got casual button downs and go check out their tall collection. So, if you are a taller guy, they've got you covered with shirts that have three inches of extra length. Now, this shirt right here, this is their slim cut and normally a shirt that fits me this close in the torso would feel uncomfortable. But guys, this feels perfectly fine. I know a lot of you guys want a cut like this and what's great about this is you're not going to sweat. You're not going to get any hot spots. This is going to be perfect for the summer. An amazing company making great shirts, guys. Go check them out. I will link down in the description to Miz and Main with the best deal you're ever going to find out there. So, this next hack, really easy. Take your favorite face lotion, body lotion, put it in the refrigerator and then whenever you put it on your body, guess what? It's going to be nice and cool. Now, for me, this one was a little bit too much of a shock but since I know a lot of you guys are much tougher than me, I think you're going to enjoy it. Next up, gentlemen, bring back the handkerchief. Carry it in your back pocket so whenever you're sweating, you don't have to just sit there and sweat. You can actually take a cotton handkerchief and you just wipe away the sweat. Your grandfather knew this hack. It's time you brought it back. And if that's not your cup of tea, carry around a simple deodorizing wipe. What I also like about these is if you're traveling, you need to be able to clean off your, you know, your armpit area. These work great. The next hack, gentlemen, start using no-show socks. They remain hidden. They actually do a great job of sucking up a lot of that moisture, a lot of that sweat, and that protects your shoes from damage. Now, speaking of the no-show sock, let's talk about a shoe style that looks great with them and that is the classic penny loafer. This is a classic summer shoe. It's relatively cool but it can still get hot. So, how do you cool down while maintaining style? Boom! All of a sudden, you bring in a perforated leather shoe. This is basically where you've got holes in the leather. It looks great especially with those no-show socks. So, this next hack is more of a warning of what to avoid and that is regular and heavyweight jeans. Regular jeans are going to be about 12 to 15 ounces per square yard. Heavyweight jeans about 16 to 24 ounces. You do not want to wear these during the summer. Now, let's say you are able to find some lightweight jeans at about 8 to 10 ounces. That's good but you're still going to have the issue with the weave. Jeans in general are not going to be very breathable but you want to look at some other options. So, first up, let's talk tropical weight trousers. Tropical weight trousers are going to be your 
dressiest option and these are going to be cooler than shorts, especially in a lighter color that's going to reflect the heat. Next up, let's talk about chinos. So, I know a lot of you guys have heard of chinos, but very few of you actually own a fun pair, maybe in blue, maybe in red. You can have a lot of options here and this is the time to be able to pull this off. And now, let's talk about my favorite summer trouser, linen. Now, I do like linen that has a little bit of a blend because that helps prevent all the issues you've got with them wrinkling all the time and the key with linen is making sure that it's woven in a way that it's going to be breathable. So, never buy a pair of linen trousers or linen shirt that's really heavy weight. You want something that's going to allow the air to flow through. Now, what about a hack pertaining to headwear? The issue with headwear for men is that it's not something most of us are used to wearing a hat like this, but in a situation in which it's very functional. I bought this when I was at an air show. I didn't have anything to cover my head. I was outside all day and this simply served a purpose. So, you start to say, okay, can I bring this into my wardrobe? You start that by practicing. Maybe it's going to be something a bit more stylish, something that, hey, I don't know if I'm going to feel comfortable. Well, the hack here is to start to wear this around your house. When you practice wearing something, you become used to wearing it. You feel more confident, you feel better and then all of a sudden, you can pull it off. So, the next hack to stay cool, look stylish, instead of going for t-shirts and shorts, guys, go for the long sleeve shirt, go for the full length trousers. Think about it, gents. It makes sense. When you protect your body from the light, from the energy of the sun, you are going to remain cooler. You're not only going to be cooler temperature wise, but you're going to look much more stylish and you can always roll those sleeves. Speaking of which, wondering how I got this great looking roll, this is called the AFA roll. Curious? Check out this video right here, five ways to roll your dress shirt or roll your casual shirt. And here's a secret bonus tip for those of you that have to wear a jacket in hot weather, go for an unlined jacket. So, you can open it up and you can tell when you look on the inside. I right here, we've got the plain material. This one's made from linen, so that's great and the air is going to be able to breathe right here on my back. What you want to avoid are is a full polyester. So, it's going to be on cheaper suits and you're going to see them fully lined with that polyester. Avoid that if you're going to wear it in the heat. Otherwise, it's going to be like a sweat box on you. 